welcome to the arcade, everybody. We're back in Farming Sim 22. I think this is actually going to give a fairly decent amount of canola. As you can hear, my remark, my colleague, that this is going to be a long day for us. We got a lot of stuff going on. Currently, Gully is working on the canola field. The, what is that? Is that weed over here or barley? Barley. Barley. The barley yeah, field over here is ready to go. Clover field's ready to go, alfalfa field's ready to go, linseed field's ready to go. Uh, isn't it weird that every so often we just decide to start talking to himself? Yeah, yeah. I kind of makes think he's recording. I don't find it weird at all that I'm talking to myself. I talk to myself all the time. Some of the best conversations I've had are with myself. <laughs> Someone on the same intellectual wavelength. Exactly. The only conversations you've had is with yourself. Probably, yeah. You know, nobody else listens to me, so... It's the only other person that's as sane as I am. <laughs> if you're going to need to go and do um, picking up his grass in a minute, you can just dump that trailer there and I'll just fill into it. Take your time on me. Oh, I'm glad you're cutting this field. I can fix that path now. What do you mean? Yeah, I'm just getting a little narrow. Oh, well, where the field keeps expanding. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Chaps wants to put borders on today. It's not a bad shout. Because it's after like at the top of the field, it now grows right up to the brick wall. Yeah, after he harvests, you know, after the fields are harvested, he wants to put borders on, so. I often do that, do a little concrete border or an asphalt border around the outside. I think all these fields need it because of the bush lines. Yeah. Makes it a hell of a lot easier. What happened here? I've been like you're trying to draw a stick man in the clover. <laughs> I was. Don't you look good? I, I kind of started messing you. up. I started messing up at the bow tie.
this is what happens when you never played Bone Simulator. Bone <laughs> Simulator? The Bone Simulator. I never played it, so I don't actually know how to properly mow a yard. <laughs> I did try it. Did you seriously? Yeah. Yeah, I might have just stopped myself doing that. I apologize to all the people out there who have played Boeing Simulator and actually enjoy that game. There are many times I almost got it, but I managed to stop myself. Each time I managed to convince myself it would just be boring. replant it with. Oh yeah, it is a complete bye-bye. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> I believe this is becoming grass. Just grass. normal grass. We get more production out of grass. We seem to, don't we? For someone who doesn't want to play mowing simulator. <laughs> we end up planting a lot of grass fields. I believe chaps is looking at the top going to be grass. Uh, not me. Uh, I went around so <laughs> last time I, we were here we hadn't actually managed to make a decision. Surprise, surprise. Oh. It's hard enough getting people to pick what job they want to do, let alone what fields to plant. <laughs> hey, we all picked jobs pretty easily today. We did. It does seem as though grass does give us more than what clover and alfalfa does. Don't know if they grow differently or not. But Let's do strawberries. Strawberries? The greenhouses for that. Yeah, I don't think strawberries is a field. Yeah. It'd be quite cool if you could do a full field of strawberries and tomatoes and stuff, but you can't. They all have to go in greenhouses. Unless, of course, someone's made a mod. We're in Ireland, just do potatoes. <laughs> potatoes and Irish beef, yeah? This field will take forever to do potatoes. Most fields take forever if you do potatoes. sell this canola so the trailer is empty to harvest another field because of course we've got nowhere to store it so I need to go and sell each trailer as we do it so you can't mix them buy more trailers <laughs> you buy more trailers I think so... it'd be cheaper to buy a silo for more trailers <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think we definitely 
the silo is definitely going to be something we need because Canada. you're keeping the linseed for now, right? Yeah, we want that for the chickens. Yeah. Uh, 5.13 at Valley Spring Mart. Okay, let's go over there. The question is, what happens if we don't feed the chickens? Do they die? They stop producing eggs. Oh, but they don't die. Oh, I don't know. We got any enhanced animal mod, haven't we? No. So they might die. I don't know if that linseed is going to be enough to feed them for an entire year. Uh, a barley problems. as well. The barley is also able to be fed to chickens. Okay. So we've got a field of barley and a field of linseed. I guess uh, it will depend how many chickens we buy as well. So let's get past to sell everything and go to the Valley Spring Mart, it's worth a bit more. Some do. Mm, I'm not sure which ones we've actually got. Let's have a look at that. That wasn't a log, no, that. <laughs> it's nine grand. And that was a whole field? Yeah. And you know what? That's not bad, though. It's really not. If you look at it what some of the worse. stuff. Yeah. If you look at some of the stuff we've been getting, you know, I'll take the nine grand. Busted. Yeah. Yes. It's 87,000 for a farm silo. Smooth ball, half beam platform. really aren't in these silos, are there? No, there aren't. That's why I said about before we get yeah. too far involved with all this, do we want to... Oh, we will definitely want to. Put a mod pack in for silos. Oh, we will want to, yes. There are loads of mod hub though, so it's not difficult. I think what I will do is on the way back here to the farm, I won't take this back to the farm, I'll go straight to the barley field, park it up and then go and grab the combine. It would make more sense.
that's all the way down to the bloody gate. Enable straw, lower, turn on. <laughs> Why, what you done? I'm 
watching him go forward and back as much as I'm going forward and back. Oh. Uh, <laughs> Notice how quiet he's being right now? Yep. Merge this stuff together. What do you mean? I was kind of wondering that myself. I was on top of the clover. I was kind of wondering that myself because in the trailer it just says it's chaff. It doesn't differentiate between the two. You should be able to in that case. If it's not showing as alfalfa chaff and clover chaff separately, I don't see why you could. I think since we got rid of oh. base plus, we are good to do that. I don't know for sure though. I didn't really want to try it, but you know. I totally did not realize that I was at a hundred percent. Field destruction. You pulled a jester. I did. Sunny pool. Why is he coming up with funny lines? And I was like, yeah, yeah, that'd be why. Well, luckily, I saw it straight away. Now, I was lucky that I was at the corner of the field, so I was already stopped. <laughs> I noticed the lines didn't look right. Mine only was about 10 feet long when I finally yeah. realized it. Yeah, mine's hardly any at all. I noticed it straight away, luckily. Is when you go all the way around the field and then realise. Like, I know, oh, right? Oh. <laughs> I wonder if, for the time being, you know, we've got that big garagey type thing next to the vehicle sheds with the slidey doors. Because that's covered over, I wonder if we could just dump the barley on the floor, just that then when we want to pick it up again we'll have to use the dump bin thing. All it'll do is dump a solid material on the floor. Right. Uh, we've also got to work out where the chicken coop's going to go. I thought you were going to put in that quarter. Yeah, we can try. We'll have to do an attempt at a bit of landscaping first, just to flatten out that corner. Because otherwise, if I let the computer do it, it'll just be a great big hill in the middle of our field, and we don't really want that. The computer doesn't take any consideration when it does auto landscape. <laughs> I don't mind giving it a go. I make no promises, but I'll give it a go. Because the only flat, flat place you don't like the idea of anyway. Sticking it in the back corner of the uh, BGA. That's so unreal. <laughs> 
listing that. <laughs> just gonna hide the chickens in the BGA. No one will know. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> Or we could sell that really awkwardly shaped garage that we've got at the end and then that would just reveal a flat space of land. Paint it with grass and put the chickens there. Yeah. Assuming they are all individual garages and they're not all linked together somehow. They're probably linked. done. Now I get the fun task of going and doing the uh, VGA making silage. So I'm going to go <laughs> ahead and cut it here. Well, I thank you all for watching. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button, ring that bell notification, let you know every time we upload a video. And we'll see you all in the next one. Have a great day, everybody.